this lockdown pay-per-view is that not only are all the matches contested inside the six sides of steel, but the different stipulations for all of the matches as we see Michael Shane, the first of four competitors to head to the ring. I think there's a story here. Check out who's accompanying him. We've seen Trinity and Michael Shane align over the course of the past week or so on Impact on. Well, we know the competition between Trinity and Tracy. Of course, Michael Shane needs to be aligned with Tracy. And any chance I think that Trinity can take to get a dig on Tracy, he's going to. Former X Division champion, Michael Shane, first man in. Keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, that this X Division escape match will be battled under pinfall or submission rules until we eliminate two of the four men. When we get down to the final two, and only at that point, it will be winner by escape. The idea is that you must climb up and over the top of this steel cage and then all the way down, first man to touch the floor, will it be Sanjay Dutt. He's the second man inside the six sides of steel. Think about this. We didn't even have time to catch our breath. One right after the other, folks. You got your money's worth. It's cage match after cage match after cage match. And we're going to look at this one now, and you're going to see four of the biggest, fastest, and most agile athletes in the world all trying to get down to that final two. And then they got to really show their agility as they got to figure out a way to escape the steel cage. Two of these four men, Chris Saban being the second, former expedition champions, and here is out of the four, the newest member of the TNA roster. A superstar from Mexico. For many years, Shocker has been drawing capacity crowds to Arena Mexico in Mexico City. A building, ladies and gentlemen, that holds over 15,000 fans. Just recently, Shocker has shocked the wrestling world in Mexico by jumping to the AAA promotion. He's turned the business in Mexico upside down. He's an individual, Don, that, that has that kind of impact. Oh, he is, and he is somebody whose popularity is not just in Mexico, and it's gaining worldwide attention. How about the McDonald's well, commercial? Absolutely. I mean, how big, does it, how, how big does it get? Everybody's now getting a chance to see him, and that's what is, is the best thing to say about total nonstop action, because TNA is getting so big that stars from all over the world are trying to get themselves seen on TNA and become a part of this promotion and it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and better. You're right, the realization has set in. The wrestling world understands that TNA is now available all over the world. What was it that we heard from JB now? Up to 53 countries that TNA is Tonight. available to be viewed. Of course, New Zealand, welcome to you as well. First time to catch us live on pay-per-view. Sanjay Dutt, good to see Chris him back to in. off. You're right, good to see Sanjay back in TNA, direct to TNA from Bombay, India. I'll tell you what, this guy can do some things in the ring, and you can see he's bulking up a little bit, too, as, as he realizes that you've got to have a little bit of that strength if you're going to be able to hang with a little bit bigger of the athletes. But he's so quick, and there you see the strength right there as he lets Saban have it with the elbow. But he's so agile. Look at this. It's like watching a circus out there. These guys are so acrobatic. We are getting word that Chris Candido has been taken away from the impact zone in an ambulance. Trainer saying backstage that he suffered a broken leg in our first match here at lockdown. Any further updates, we'll pass them on to you. You know, when it happened, like, like you said, we've seen him cry possum so many times. That right, we you have he, to question it. Yeah, that he was doing something sneaky there. And again, though, you, you realize how brutal it is inside the six sides of steel. As it happened right in match one, and we're only in the third one tonight. We've got five more after this. Again, keep in Look mind. Look at Sanjay Dutt go! How many, wow! How many revolutions did he make? That oh, was oh, unbelievable. Wow. I just looked over and couldn't help but I even saw a grin on Shocker's face. Like, what was that? Punctuating it with that. Great oh. scissors take over, and it's answered by the Hurricane Rana by Saban. Wow. Great competitors in the X Division. Tag is in. Our opportunity to see Shocker. We mentioned earlier, famous in the United States, both for being a part of the Lucha Libre phenomenon in Mexico, but also because of that incredible appearance in that McDonald's commercial. 
I think for about six months there, Don, you couldn't turn on the TV without seeing it. Oh, he'd pull off the mask, and then the, then the face became the mask. It was it was great. But I'll tell you something. My ass shocker, what was it that wanted to make you come here to TNA? What, made, what was the biggest thing that made you want to be a part of this? And you know what he told me? He wanted to show off his skills against these ex-division athletes because he said they're the best in the world. And he's doing just that right now. Even to grab the side headlock on Michael Shane out of the move and then drive him down. Face first to the mat. Follow up in the corner with a knife edge chop. Shocker going to take Shane and drive him across and does into the turnbuckles. Follows up with the left oh. face jam. Man. Just slam the face right down into the mat right there. Is Michael Shane on the losing end of this right here. Shocker just going to town, makes a quick tag, and now Sanjay doesn't shock them. They're just like they're teaming up together. They sure are. Oh, beautiful teamwork. Well, if you can team up together to eliminate one of the other That's wrestlers, right. Almost like a survivor situation. Pair down that field. Once we get down to the final two, that's when the escape rules come into effect, and that's when the competitors will try and win the match by climbing up and over the top of the six sides of steel. First man down to the floor ends up winning the match, but that's only after two wrestlers have been eliminated. And you make a great point. I mean, it'd be smart to make an alliance. It'd be smart to go into this ahead of time and say, hey, let's work together so that we get it down to the two of us. Then all bets are off. But that's competition. You understand that. And that's exactly what we're seeing here. Look at this. Oh, oh man. Incredible teamwork from Saban and Sanjay Dutton. Michael Shane can't find a friend out there. Sanjay with an assist from Saban almost puts him away. Oh, they love the X Division here at the oh, Impact Zone and all over the world. What oh. incredible athletes. High elevation that time. Michael Shane taking Sanjay, tossing him high up into the air, and he went face first into the cage. I'll tell you what, you can't give... Michael Shane an inch or he'll take a mile. This guy is so sharp. He's a former X Division champion. Somebody that held that title a long time and he's got so many skills and so many weapons and now he's got control and he's going to roll Sunday got up on here but no not enough hit the short arm clothesline immediately went for the cover you can even see the blood on the shoulder there of Michael Shane any contact that you have done with this unforgiving very dauntless steel cage as we see him now hooking Sanjay up in the corner, but any contact that you have, it's going to open you up. I mean, look at right there as you see the, where the camera goes through. He's got no room to move. Once you get your foot stuck in there, that's what he's got. He can't get out of that right now. And, oh, he's at the mercy of Michael Shane, and he just levels him with the kick right in the What are you going to do? Caught him with the baseball slide. Here's no barely gets a, not even a two count from referee Slick Johnson before Sanjay is able to use his leg strength to power out. I'll tell you what, that was a great camera shot right there as you saw the feet of Michael Shane coming right in. There was no where for Sanjay Dutt to go, and that's how quickly the momentum can turn inside that small area right there. What a great job by all of our cameramen here at this lockdown event. You know, oftentimes difficult, Don, to see through, to get great visuals because of the six sides of Steel Cage, but that's not been the case tonight. I'll tell you what, it was a great move right there. What they did was they, they put a section of the cage where the camera could actually view inside. Great idea. You could see it right there. Great idea, great shot. That way you don't have the... The distraction, the distortion of all the different uh, of all the different cages right there in front of you. Whoever came with that idea, fantastic. Yeah. Job. Also, it's what separates TNA from everybody else. Sanjay charges in. Michael Shane able to get the boots up in the chest. Gonna go for the quick pin attempt here. Two. Nope. Sanjay still powers out at two. I'll tell you what, Sanjay Dutt. We talked about how great it is to see him back in here, but. He walked right into this. I mean, he was able to get into the shot at this this escape, that we call it. But over there in Japan, he's been away from TNA for a little while, but how quickly he comes back. Look at that. Moots all off the top, lands on his feet, charges at Shane. Shane able to elevate him up. Oh, you can see Michael Shane trying to fight it off with all he could. He tried, but the leg strength of Sanjay allowed him to take him over with the head scissors. And now the tag is into Saban. And Saban and Shane, we've seen these two battle it out on many occasions. Two of the real stalwarts of the X Division. The reversal sends Saban in. Oh, look, look at Saban holding on for everything. A great move by Michael Shane as he just rammed his head right back into the cage. You're right, he just backed up. Oh, oh no, back of the head into the cage. Michael Shane is basically taking him on one on three right now. Smart, smart move that time by Michael Shane. The momentum sending Saban in. Pin attempt, nope, leads to another near fall. And Michael Shane has had. Several near falls on Sanjay Dutt. A couple here on Saban. 
but no luck so far. Michael Shane has got to get a tag into somebody and somehow try to find a way to get a breather. He's just going to have to do it. They might try to avoid one. But it seems to me that the three people have been teaming up on him from the beginning. And I guess that's from the history of all the times that Michael Shane has, has screwed these guys in the past. But you could see Chris Shane. Oh, nice duck. There he comes. Oh, yes. DDT's him off the top of the rope. Springboard into that tornado DDT. Still not able to go for the pin attempt as we look over the shoulder of Trinity at ringside. Chris Saban can get his, find his way to get on top of Michael Shane right there. Shocker sees an opening here. Oh, look you at you him, see the way yeah. he's perched. It's almost as if he knows that if he stays out, he survives longer. But at the same time, if you see the opening and you might be able to put away one of these men, you eliminate them from the field. He's got to, you've got to take advantage of someone when they're vulnerable like that. And that's exactly what Shocker saw. Close line, scoop slam. Oh, oh. smooth was that. Spring back on the ropes. No, Michael Shane fights out of it. Shocker reversed off of the ropes by Shane. Nice slide through to avoid the cut. Oh, perfectly placed drop kick. Took out his knee. Look at this. Look at roll up. One, two. Did he get it? No. no. That beautiful rolling mahi straw cradle only enables him to gain a two count on Shane. Wow, I don't know how Michael Shane was able to get out of that. Pure resilience, nice boot up there to the face. Shocker feeling so confident that he came charging at Shane. Shane able to get the boot up. Holding, oh, wait a minute, he's falling down. He's gonna go, oh, look at this. You see now. Look at everybody. Oh, 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 Michael Shane is in no man's land. He's in no man's land. And Sanjay also in the Boston Cup. Yeah, so no Shocker, Shane. look at Shocker. You're right. Oh, unbelievable. Chris Saban's the only one that had the advantage there. Oh, look at that. This, unbelievable action. This is what it is that separates TNA from everyone else that makes total nonstop action wrestling so special. Shot off into the corner. Sanjay follows. Wild kick by Saban, but it connected. I don't think there's any partnerships going on right now. I think everybody realized it's... Oh! oh. Just slaps it down! Running sit-out powerbomb, but Shocker was there with the perfectly placed drop kick. Not sure about that strategy. Should have allowed him to be eliminated. Up to the shoulder. It's the adrenaline right there. You just caught up in the emotion, and it almost comes to a point where you want to be the one getting the pin. You're right. Cover here, and no, I thought Shocker was going to be the one to make the first elimination. Forearm shot off the ropes. Saban avoids the kick. Oh! oh. Right to the back of the head. Right to the back of the head. And look at... Oh, did you see Sanjay got... One, two... Oh! What was Michael Shane thinking right there? I'm not sure. What was he thinking? You're right. He should have just allowed him to be eliminated. Shocker would have been gone. But I'll tell you what again. I think it's a, it's a matter of pride now. Yeah, right. You don't want to stand there and watch somebody get pinned. You want to do the pinning, but... That was the move that Michael Shane shouldn't have made. Sanjay went for the Hurricane Rana. Stop. Oh. oh, blocked by Shane, who then sends him right directly into the cage. Oh, you can see that. Oh, super kick planted perfectly. And then Shocker plants one perfectly. Oh, man. Shocker drops the elbow. Here's the lateral press. Here's the three count. He got him, and he's eliminated. Sanjay Dutt. That's elimination number one. One down. Once we get another elimination and once we're down to the final two competitors and only at that time the escape rules will be in place where you must escape the cage. It's a matter of survival right now. Wow, look at the strength of Shocker as he's able to reverse that to his favorite again. Right there on the knee, man, right in the gut of Michael Shane. Tilt to whirl and did drop him. That first across the knee. Shocker going to go high risk up to the top. There goes Saban. Quickly, Saban sprints across the ring. Oh, 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 oh. Can you imagine the impact coming off the top rope like that? It suplexes him, and now we have three bodies laid out inside the six sides of steel. Great X Division action. Arm extended, Saban on shocker. And there you see from behind Michael Shane in to break it up. And the two rivals. Saban and Shane go at it now. Face first goes Saban into the top turnbuckle. Now positioned up on top. What does Michael Shane have in mind here? And at the same time, you got to be wary because you've got your back turned to Shocker. That's absolutely right. You cannot take your, your eyes off of anybody if it's all possible in that ring right there because you still can be eliminated. And 
<laughs> it's a high risk move, but it's higher risk than ever when you take your eyes off your opponent. Oh, you can like see Michael what, Shane is ooh, doing here. Chris Saban just planted his face. Wait a minute! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's Trinity Wait, doing? Trinity climbing up near the top. What's she doing? Obviously, trying to come to the aid of Michael Shane. Oh wait, wait there goes Tracy. Tracy going up to stop her because oh oh and oh, look at that right there. And Trinity just kicks her down. There's another one holding the leg. And she I'm crashed down. Oh my gosh, man! I don't. Oh, I hope she didn't do the same. Wait a minute. Oh, you can see just screaming in pain. Wait a minute. Go to the camera. To oh my God. You got oh my God. Crazy. Trinity on no the top way. of the cage. No way. No way. You've got to be kidding me. Wow, the crowd's going crazy. Just when you think you've seen it all, you watch a TNA pay-per-view and you see an incredible move like that. This woman jumped out of airplanes. She's driven motorcycles out of airplanes. So I guess we should be surprised if she can moonsault off the top of the game. But look at this again. What a great shot. Yeah. Absolutely fearless. The female daredevil moonsaulting off the top. Here comes Tracy. Oh, caught her blindsided. Laid her off with the clotheslines. Oh, look at this. Michael oh. Shane sends Tracy out of the ring. He just flung her right through the door. The door was open for her to come in, and he sent her out. This could be cradle shock. And there it is. Did you see it? Yes, he hits it. One, two. Saban has eliminated Michael Shane. We're down to the final two. We're down to Shocker. We're down to Chris Saban. And now it's escape rules. And Shocker's already headed up the cage. Oh, he saw the opportunity. That was smart thinking on Shocker's part. While Chris Saban is reveling in the glory of getting the pin, Shocker didn't waste any time. Now you saw Saban realizing what's going on, and it's on. And now both men scaling the side of the cage. Shocker. And Saban both with knife edge chops. Who's going to hang in there the longest? Face first into the steel. No Saban. Ooh, they're just trading blows right there. I mean, you've got to hold on for dear life, and there they go, both of them. Just get the shots right where you know where it hurts the worst. Both Michael Shane and Sanjay Dutt have been eliminated. We're down to the final two. First of these two competitors to scale the cage up one side, down the other, and to land and make contact with the floor will be the winner. And Shocker's got quite a lead. He's got the Oh, advantage. he's close. He's almost out. Can Chris Saban stop it in time? And you know what? you got to be careful about your landing from up there. That's why you just can't go climbing up and jump over. You go, oh, wait a minute. Shocker's got it now. Chris Saban, is they're both out, who's going to get to the floor first? Both oh. men on equal footing here. Both equally down. Oh! Who got it? Shocker, got I think. It. Shocker in a photo finish. Oh, you got to be kidding. That was so close. But think about it. It was the impact of Saban driving him into the cage that allowed Shocker to drop down to the floor. Saban, I think, just in a split second realized that he had to go as well. But he was just this much short. And in a photo finish, Shocker gets the win in the X Division Escape. I mean, think about that. You're up there battling. You want to make sure your your opponent's on base, and you've got to, you got to watch your ball. You see so many people already falling and hurt their feet. Let's, let's look how close it. this is, though. Saban realized it. It's just too late. It's yeah, just that that millisecond, that split second of realization when it sent in. He knew at the same time that he needed to drop to the floor as well. But Shocker was already there. Let's take this camera angle. Oh, man, look at right there. He, oh, and it did. That was a little time. There you it see worked it. against him. It worked against him there, Mike.